look, it's Rachel Moore. Hi guys! Why'd you wear such a conservative costume? <laughs> Because there's families here. This is a family orientated. Yes, and nothing says family fun like Tanya Tate. <laughs> I know, yes. Are you worried one day Sam might eat you? <laughs> Probably. If we go ranging beyond the wall and we run out of food. Which one of you is the evil one? Uh, that would have to be. Question. That'd have to be me. You're Captain America. Captain America, the Bucky Rescue outfit. And these stars represent the only three good states in America. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hey, look, it's Jenny. Hi, Joe. Long time no see. You're dressed as Snow White again. Uh, yes, a different variation of so Snow White. I am super Snow White. Your superpower is getting poisoned and waiting for a man to rescue you. <laughs> only in your dreams, Joe. Are you going to wear this to church tomorrow? Church? It's Easter. Oh yeah, people do actually go to church on Easter. No. Why do you have to be such a bitch to your sister? Oh, well, I don't mean to. You have got to be so careful when you take a piss. I do, yes. <laughs> Dracarys. <laughs> no, Dracarys. No, no. It's broken. Oh, no. Hawkeye is my favorite Avenger. I know that's a weird... Hawkeye? Hawkeye. You, oh my god, if I... And Ringo's your favorite beetle. And you God's your favorite member of the Wu-Tang Clan. I don't know what that is. Why are you so evil? Oh, I'm a Republican. Is this the new Apple Watch? Yeah, it is. Isn't it nice? It's pretty fancy. Bigger than I thought it would be. Yeah, it's a lot bigger than I should have been. How do you cosplay as Tanya Tate? Do you just like show up at a convention naked? No, you get thrown out. Think you'll ever be as cool as Cyclops? <laughs> Gosh, I don't know. He's kind of a dick. How many books have you written? 127, 28, who counts? Something like How that. Do you, what's the secret to writing so many books? Is it cocaine? <laughs> no, well, Starbucks, really. I just picture your closet is all Snow White dresses. <laughs> I missed your fake laughter. Oh. <laughs> it's so forced and ugh. I'm about halfway through, well, about 200 pages into uh, a uh, Feast of Crows. So then, that's about the start of the fifth. You get to the part where Tyrion dies. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I know. John Snow falls off the wall, and you get to the part where Sansa and Arya hook up. Oh no, I haven't read that. Part yet. That, that, that sounds pretty interesting. I mean, George R. R. Martin is a sick man. Yes, he is. I mean, with all the brother and sister stuff going on, and yeah. you know, now sister, sister. So <laughs> I'm cosplaying as an idiot. You pull it off really well. I am very hyped for Star Wars, of course, like any other. Are you? You aren't. You aren't still hurt from the prequels. You, you're um, excited again. Okay, this is a thing. I'm the only one who likes Episode I like, One. I like Episode One. I like Episode One. Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! I'm the only one who also likes Jar Jar Binks. I'm the only one who likes. Okay, I don't like, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest here. You ever banged Mystique? <laughs> I might have, I don't know. <laughs> you never know! <laughs> oh, no. You guys were in an episode of Joe Date. Yes, as Tanya from Mortal Kombat. Why didn't you call me back? <laughs> uh, the gift you gave me, you know, not a, that's a deal breaker. Cat food, nine lives. Actually, I hate cats and I'm allergic to them. Do I look like a big purple hippo? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really like the date, sorry. But I also have to say that you have lost weight because, Joe, you're, ooh, is that a, how many pack is that? That's a four pack. I got four down there. <laughs> this is so cool that your dad's here with you. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's pretty awesome. My dad would never come to WonderCon. Oh, really? Uh, He'd just walk around and be like, for weird! <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you want to dress up like that for? Oh I'm, I'm kind of that way too with a few things. <laughs> These guys act as my translator. It's like, what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. what, what do you think? It's Halloween? <laughs> yes, that's a very frequent one. What are you trick or treating? <laughs> I wish we got candy for doing this. That'd be awesome. Yeah, right. <laughs> you should go home and pay your bills. <laughs> <laughs> that's a new one. <laughs> You're prepared for me this year. You brought a huge spear. Exactly, because that date was so bad that, you know, <laughs> just in case you try again, I can fight you off. You should really get into the spirit of the 40s and be, like, super sexist and racist. I could, I could, but then if some of my friends saw this, then I'd get in a lot of trouble. You'd be like, hey, I'm just being in character. This is what the world was like back then. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, I could show that Captain America isn't as invincible as he should be if he, that's the direction he wanted to go. He wasn't really that much bigger. You just had, like, a belly. <laughs> I was actually pregnant and I just had the baby. Is that what it is? You should have just let yourself go before you did this costume. <laughs> There's enough of those out already. Can I touch it? Okay, I gotta stop. I feel like that, that's gonna end up on a fetish site or something. Yeah, I, I have to say I was getting warm feelings from that. The next time a kid comes up to you and asks for a picture, you should say no.
<laughs> oh, why? It's just to make the tears. No, I could never do that. I like your tooth necklace. Oh, thank you. I forgot I was wearing it. <laughs> I also have a necklace of all my baby teeth. Aww, <laughs> let me wear that. Yeah, maybe I'll give it to you. Wouldn't that be romantic? Maybe I'll call you back this time. Oh, I got a great idea. Let's eat this dragon. No, no, this is my baby. My mouth, my mouth is watering just thinking about it. <laughs> no, this is my baby. So let me take a bite of the dragon. No, 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 no. What's the latest Snow White news? Um, no news as of yet, just more and more Disney live action things, which I really am not looking forward to, especially the new pan that's going to be live action. I'm not, I'm, just stick with the originals. We don't need any more. <laughs> did you like live action Cinderella? I did. It was very beautiful, but I mean. You're a hypocrite. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. You know what this means now? You're the fat one. I'm the skinny one, and you're the fat one now. Do you know why? You might be right. <laughs> He's my baby. I sacrificed everything for him. On the other hand, fried dragon. Oh. oh I just, just put it in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> just put it in. I don't want to talk to him anymore. <laughs> you have no idea how often I hear that. <laughs> to be continued. Subscribe, Subscribe to Joe go. go! Or else he gets it! Is there anything you want to plug? Apart from your mouth and probably your backside. That's what you're really cosplaying as, a hypocrite. <laughs> Damn it, Joe, you figured me out again. I freestyle rap. Give me a suggestion, and I'll make up a rap about it. Here we go. Yes, <laughs> yes, best part. Um, Do it. Give him something. Um, <laughs> wow, I can't think of anything. Let's do... I can't think of anything. Well, that suggestion stank. I'm sorry that your mind is so freaking blank. You can't think of anything, nothing at all. So what am I going to do now? Do I stall and wait for you to think of one word in your head? I think I might prefer it if you were dead. You're not helping me out. You're not giving me anything. Something with a wall up on the, with the snow and the... Well, my name's Bina White and I'm a nice guy. I'm just like the wall because I am quite high. Wellington boots. <laughs> A lot of girls are saying Joe's cute. Could it be because I got Wellington boots? They feel so good and I look neat when I put those boots right up on my feet. But I can keep going. I just got another notch in my belt. I decided to join the Night's Watch. Why not? I know you don't get paid, but it's fine. It's not like I'm out getting laid. Anyway, then I take the boots off and I smell it to see if my feet still smell like hell. And then Tanya asked if she can get a sniff. She can't go to sleep without her Joe Hansen whiff. Oh. God, that's awful. My name is Sony. It rhymes with baloney. I love macaroni. I don't know how to rhyme. Subscribe to Joe Goes Mate. Yeah. No worries, mate. Sweet as. Subscribe. I like contestants. I love Battle Shame. You, <laughs> you should come and look at it.